Harry Butts, Justin Trudeau's former secretary, is spreading misinformation and conspiracy theories. You've maybe seen this viral trend by now where regular Canadians are posting saying, hey, I'm married, I have three kids, I work really hard, but according to Justin Trudeau, I am an extremist that needs to be dealt with. This trend has absolutely taken off, going viral on Twitter. And so what does Jerry Butts say about this organic trend that started? The real question is, who is paying for this campaign? Could it be Vladimir Putin, Jerry? There's no way Canadians would just stand up for themselves and call out the ridiculous accusations of their prime minister, right? That would never happen. It must be the Russians. And then Jerry doubles down saying these aren't even real people. Sending a ton of bots to insist this isn't a bot campaign is not a super strong strategy. Do you have any evidence of these people being bots, Jerry? Hashtag that's very dehumanizing of you that everyone who would be complaining about your former boss is a bot. Anyway, the starter of the trend, Marty Up North, made a video saying, hey, me and all the people who have made these posts are very real, Jerry. You're kind of crazy. Then Jerry responds, I don't doubt Marty is real. Sadly, he's being used. By who? It was the Russians, Jerry. It was the Russians. They're putting microchips in Canadian mills. Here's an old Jerry Butts tweet. Some big league misinformation being thrown at Canada these last few days. Gotta hate that misinformation, eh, Jerry? Information spreads at lightning speed. And by the way, the only clarification he's making here is, hey, that woman who got crushed by a police horse, she didn't die. She just got crushed by a police horse. Her skull did not even get crushed. So that is a misinformation. I'm Jerry Butts. And let's not forget, Jerry is the guy who shamefully resigned after the SNC-Lavalin scam. And although he resigned in 2019, many people still think he's pulling the strings. I wouldn't be surprised if Jerry works directly with the news media outlets themselves to help craft the narrative. Oh, what do you know? There's Jerry having dinner with a journalist who was the debate moderator for the election debate a week before the debate happened. So we shouldn't really be surprised by this unethical behavior from Jerry. I mean, he's clearly desperate trying to hold on to the narrative to the point where he's just spreading all sorts of lies and misinformation and literally inventing conspiracy theories off the top of his head. Of course, these double standards are so irritating, they're going to spread misinformation, conspiracies, dehumanize people, and then never apologize, while simultaneously accusing all of their political opponents of doing the same. But what do I know? I'm someone who doesn't like Justin Trudeau, so I must be paid off, also a robot, also being manipulated by someone. Silly Jerry. All right, Putin, I made the video.